Hi, it's Andrew Armstrong. Welcome to the back office. Have you ever been sent a document that's in a word format but cannot be edited? That's because the author's decided that you are not worthy to edit it. No matter what you do, type, 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 it just pops up these things. You might click, try to click stop protection, password, I don't know it. And it can be so infuriating because all you might want to do is just change the margins just so that you can print it. Well, here's a solution for you. Download 7-Zip. It's a zip program. You can get it online, 7-zip.org. It's free. It handles most formats and it integrates into Windows. So that means you can right click on the file and then you'll see 7-zip right there. Open archive. Inside the archive, look for the Word folder and then within the Word folder, find the settings.xml file. Depending on what your system is, you can click edit here and the editor will pop up. On my case, it's Notepad. This is the basic editor most of you will have. So just go straight to find and look for protect. There we go. You'll see this XML tag starts with W document protect. All you have to do is either using the mouse or keyboard, and I prefer the keyboard, I hold down shift and use the cursor keys. Find the end tag. So starting at the beginning, select all of it right through to the end tag. You'll see there's a whole lot of stuff there on algorithms and hashes. That's probably the storing just the password within the file. Then you'll see this end tag. See front slash greater than symbol. Hit delete. Bang, it's gone. File save. Close down Notepad, 7-Zip will say, do you want to update the archive? OK, job done. Close that, double click the file. Wait, wait, wait. I can edit your stuff. Weak. Brilliant. And that's how you do that. Now, if somebody sends you a doc file, so this is an old school doc file, if you double click that you'll see you'll also have the same issue doc file doc file but here's the trick just go to file save as browse save it as docx i'm going to save it as file 2 here because i've already got one 22222 there we go fine then you can just do the same trick on that file Bish, bosh, bish. It's gone. So I hope that's been of some use to you. As ever, thanks for watching.